What's up, guys? It's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Alpha Sapphire walkthrough. Okay, so in this episode right here, we're going to be going through the Battle Resort, doing some stuff, finding some stuff, battling some stuff. A lot of stuff, you know. Just a lot of stuff. Anywho, uh, let's see. Let's go straight into the Pokemon Center. I think my Pokemon are already healed, but I do want to grab somebody here because, wow. We, uh... Oh, yeah. look at that. We, we, we commemorate the first time clearing the game. Okay, so we got more more wallpaper that we're probably not going to use. And, uh, oh, it looks like we already have that Pokemon. Look at this. Got ourselves Rayquaza. Oh, look at that. This Pokemon is a tank. It's a beast. And the rest of my Pokemon are, you know, right there. I kind of want to switch out a... I, I kind of want to switch out Toxic Batman. Because we already have... Rayquaza right here, and it's it's already more than enough. So, let's see. Who is going to be the Pokemon that will replace Rayquaza? Huh. I wonder. I wonder. Okay, let's see. Now, we could always use Olay again, but, but you know, Olay has already served his purpose. And, uh, well, let's see. There is a Pokemon that we... Uh, what Pokemon do we need? Like, we could, all, we, we, we could always go back to Frostlass. I'm just saying. We could always go back to this Pokemon, but... Huh. It's a hard decision, and yeah, there's a lot of Pokemon that I've gotten over the, you know, I've gotten over the the adventure, especially through the Pokemon Bank. I'm, pr yeah, I'm still gonna be capturing Pokemon, filling up the Pokédex, trying to fill it, trying to fill it up as much as I can. Now, as you guys can see here, we do have Deoxys. It's a level 80. Just using it, it's uh, it's just it, it's just a cheat because nobody else is here is at level 80, so we're just gonna stay off of that for a little bit, and we're gonna be going straight into the battle resort. We're gonna be looking at uh, a lot of stuff right here. So here we are, battle resort. Oh my god, it's it's look at that. Okay, so you know they really they really made a, a a good decision on making this thing and well let's see i'm old and i'm retired training uh quite some time now but watching battles in uh the maze on still makes my heart pound now what pokemon is this i wonder what pokemon this is let's see it's a pokemon we haven't uh we haven't captured i am i am uh oh it's it's a mantine I think. Mantine, alrighty. Let's go ahead and capture it. Okay, so here we are. Take it on Mantine. Yeah, we've never, ever, ever captured Mantine before. And, oh, buckets. We're using the wrong Pokemon for this one right here. Oh, crud baskets. Okay, you know what? Let's go with extreme speed. See if it, like, you know, doesn't kill it. It killed it. Oh my god, it killed it. Never mind. Well, that's what happens when you use an overpowered Pokemon like Shenron right there. Yeah. Okay. So let's uh, let's let's not do that. Let's go ahead and uh, give some love to Toxic Batman right here because you know it hasn't crossed level 60 yet. And let's see. I really wanted to see the battles in the Battle Maze on live, so I begged and begged my daddy to take me here. Oh, okay. And let's see. Talk to her. Only strong trainers or wealthy people can come into this place. Either way, this place is for the selected few. Ah. Am I the selected few? Because this is awesome right here. And, well, if you go right here, there, is, there are shops. And the only way you can buy anything is through battle points. And I think you get the battle points through, you know, the Battle Maison. As you guys can see, you got a Heal Bell, Tailwind, a whole bunch of moves right here that, you know, could help in the Battle Maison. If you go into this little location, let's see, battle points, you will get block, skill swap, and everything. Now, these moves may not look like much, but in the Battle Maison, guys, they they will definitely they will de definitely uh, work just because, you know, how strategic it gets. And what else do these people uh, teach? You got Uproar, Iron Tail, Bounce, Drill Run, a whole bunch of moves that, you know, are super powerful. And, again, could help in the Battle Maison. And, uh, well, let's see. What if we talk to these people? It's one thing to enjoy leisurely battles, but real battles can be severe trial. Truly strong trainers sometimes must be prepared to choose Pokemon that can win uh, can win rather than uh, their favorite Pokemon. That is true. And 20 consecutive wins. Yeah. So, the Battle Maison, exactly like, you know, Battle Frontier. Um, yeah. I don't have the time for any of that stuff 
I know that I've been uh, saying that maybe I should and shouldn't, but, you know, it's all, it all depends on time right here. And I may not look like it, but I am very confident in my battle Pokemon skills. Oh, okay, so she's got grass types. Okay, I got the Pokemon for this situation. Let's go ahead and battle her. Okay, so here we go. Taking on Aroma Lady Carnation. And she is coming out with a victory belt. Look at this Pokemon. So, anywho, guys, uh, we are... We are definitely close to the end of this walk right here, and uh, yeah, we are moving forward with the newer walkthroughs that will eventually come out. One big walkthrough that needs to be, yeah, that needs to be attended to, needs to be focused on, aside from Pokemon White 2, is Pokemon Brilliant Diamond. Um, yes, I know, I re-recorded, or I, you know... I did I did something weird with that walkthrough. It I didn't I didn't necessarily like how I how it went by guys. So the next extra adventure walkthrough will be Pokemon Brilliant Diamond. And uh rest assured, yes, we will be yeah, we will be finishing that walkthrough. We will. I may not sound very happy about it, but yeah. <laughs> yeah, I'm not too happy about it because it's like I, I actually finished up Pokemon uh what was it, Shining Pearl? Yeah, I gotta say that, you know, they, they didn't really do a... Well, they did a good job of making it. Chibi was not my cup of tea. But it wasn't much of a, you know, it wasn't much of anything. We, like, I actually thought there was gonna be more features than just, you know, the underground path and all that stuff. Guess I was wrong. Who knows? But yes, we will be getting Pokemon uh, Brilliant Diamond. Uh, we're gonna try... We're going to try our hardest to, uh, what was it called? Um, yeah, we're going to try our hardest to finish that thing as quickly as possible because, you know, it, 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 like I've already, I've already told you guys before, the, what was it? The Sinnoh region is not really my favorite region. Never was. It never was my favorite region for some, uh, for, some, for, some for some particular reason. Um, I guess you could say that it was probably, it, it was probably because of the, the speed of the game and all that crud. And then I played Pokemon Platinum. And yeah, I guess they improved it a little, but Pokemon Platinum, it was the end all be all game. It actually had more features. It was it was exactly what it should have been. Um, in fact, Pokemon Brilliant or Pokemon Platinum should have been like the format in Pokemon uh, uh, Platinum should have been what these uh, other two walkthroughs should have been. Guess they didn't get the memo or anything like that. And I'll be right back with you guys. I'm getting a call. Okay, we're back. Yeah, getting these phone calls during the during the recording. It kind of gets annoying a little, but it was a business one. Anywho, I lost, but I had a blast. Let's battle again sometime. Yes, I am always a blast, and I am not. I am not going for that. Okay. Uh, let's see. Is there anything else that I can find right here? Maybe her. She wants to probably battle and uh, sidle dance to expect the a man's value is determined by the by his looks or income, right? You know, that is a very good question. By his looks and his income, I can attest to this. Okay, I, I, I neither have the looks, because I look like a foot. I just have the body. And the income, well, the income is alright. But, you know, people these days, I swear to God. My take in, is that a man's value is determined by how strong he is in a Pokemon battles. You know, if that was the case, I'd be swimming. Swimming. Swimming in females. But no, no Pokemon battles. Anywho, let's go ahead and and move on right here. And uh, let's see, who is this guy? There are people who are itching to battle on this uh, beach too. Ah, are you itching to battle? Battle Chatelaines. Chatelaines are here visiting from Cal the Kalos region now. They used to live in Hoenn, so it's like visiting home for them. I hear that the Battle Maison started in a shack that was around here. Ah, okay, where is this shack? I want to find this shack. Is it Shaquille O'Neal? Let's see. Oh, wow. We're in quicksand, and I wonder what this guy has to talk about. <laughs> what a stifling place. This place is, or this is just a time for a cool victory in a Pokemon battle to refresh me. I'm a poison type expert. Why don't you have a thrilling battle with me? Yes, I will. And I need to switch out my Pokemon because this is going to require a little bit of Shenron. So time to, time to pay the piper right here. Okay, let's go. Bring it on. 
Anywho, here we are taking on Rich Boy Antoine, and he is going to be coming out with a muck. And Le Muck taking on Rayquaza right here. Good old Shenron, and yes, we're going to make it evol evolve and take a look at this Dragon Ascent. So here it is. That's right. It's morphin time. Oh, yes. And so far, the I think the only Pokemon that I've mega evolved is this one right here. Yeah, look at this. Shenron looking beastly. And Delta Stream. Oh, my God. This is going to be bad. Here comes Dragon Ascent. This is the first time. And, oh, my God. Say goodbye to Muck. And because of that, our defense has fallen. Both special and, and physical. Probably should have thought that through just a little bit. And Scolipede. Okay, Scolipede. I know what you are. And you're about to... Yeah, you're about to take this. Let's go, Dragon Ascent again. Oh, yes. This is, uh, this is totally unfair. This is just unfair. Unfair business, and look at that. Scolipede has been defeated yet again. Oh, my God. Unfair. We are playing with unfair businesses right here. And, well, Thunderball grows to level 69. Toxic Batman, without doing anything, grows to level 56. And here comes Toxic Croak. Okay. You know what? We're just going to use Dragon Ascent because... At least, at least two of these Pokemon are just uh, weak against the flying types. Look at this, Dragon Ascent. Now, I don't know why this is a flying type technique. It should have been a Dragon type because it has the name Dragon in there. Oh, yes. Look at that. Look at that. Okay. So that's another one down. Leviathan grows to level 71. And here comes Drapion. Now, Drapion does sound does sound like a dragon type Pokemon, but I guess Dragon Ascent will do. <coughs> My bad. Still have a slight cough and everything, and well, there you go. And Drapion has been defeated. Look at that. Okay. And Rich Boy and, and, and Twine, whatever his name is, is giving us a fortune for this victory right here. I, I can't believe my poison type Pokemon lost. We won't lose next time. Hmm. Well, we'll see about that. Let's see. There might be a hidden item right here somewhere. No. You should always check, guys. Okay, so let's see. Is there anybody else that I can actually find right here? And that sounds like a new Pokemon right here. Where are you? Okay, so if you guys haven't noticed, I, I, uh, I'm still going through this cough right here. I mean... Granted, my, my health issues are something, but getting a cough is just ridiculous, and... Oh, it's, a uh, It's a tentacle. Never mind. Alright, let's go into this shack right here and see what this is all about. And would you look at that? Look at how many Pokeballs are there. So many. And there's a shining eye, uh, object. Now, if this guy can only move out of the way, that would be great. Okay. So, if you go into this shack right here, you'll be able to find yourself the Gengarite. Yes. For Gengar. Oh, I can't wait to start using Mega Evolution on everybody else except uh, Rayquaza and all that crud. Alrighty, and let's see what these Pokeballs hold. You're going to be finding yourself some potion or protein. Well, if it's a protein, this guy is probably going to have, yeah, a whole bunch of vitamins right here. And I think it's at this point right here, guys, that you, you, sh you probably should be thinking of, like, giving your Pokemon some vitamins because, yeah... There are going to be trainers with more strategic. The AI just gets crazy and all that stuff. Here we found ourselves an iron. That is always great. And then let's go ahead and grab this. A calcium. And, well, let's see. Let's talk to this old man right here. He's like, I'm the custodian here at the Battle Resort. All I do is take the trash out in the morning. I don't have much to do. That stuff over there is just some junk that I picked up while I was cleaning. Go on, take anything you think you could use. Wow, he... He, he seriously doesn't know anything about Mega Evolution. He kind of uh, kind of messed up right there. But anywho, let's go right ahead and continue our adventure. By talking to this guy, the other day when I was swimming, I suddenly heard a splash. Something fell into the water, but there was nothing around me. No ship, no flying Pokemon, nothing. Just a vast spread of sea. I wonder what it was. Hmm. Yes, I wonder what it was too. And, well, we're going to be seeing this little girl. 
and she is a fly or she is a uh, fairy type Pokemon trainer. That right there is a big no-no for Shenron because yeah, you know fairy types, dragon types, not the best combination right there. So let's go ahead and talk to this person again and get ourselves another Pokemon battle. Alrighty, okay. So here we are taking on Fairy Tale, Fairy Tale Girl Joseph uh, Jack. I can't, I, 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 I didn't even see the name. But the majority of these trainers will have four Pokemon, so just be aware of that, guys. And well, let's go with the Venishock. Get some, uh, let's get some experience points for our Toxic Batman right here. Look at this. Look at that. Oh wow, here comes Payback. Yeah, when it's Payback, it's never a really good thing. So here we go again, Venishock. For the win! And there we go. Gramble has been defeated. Alrighty, getting some points right there. And then Azumarill. Hmm. You know what? Let's give Thunderball a little bit of love. See what he can do. Alrighty. Thunderball. Thunderball right there. And, well, let's go right ahead and use a Discharge Attack. And... There you go, okay. Alrighty, okay, so here we go. Take it on another Slurpuff. Okay, so Slurpuff is a it's a brand new one. Not much of a fairy like a pure fairy type trainer, guys, but Slurpuff is just different. It it just looks funny, it's different. And it's exactly what it looks like. It looks like a pie or a you know cake, a big old cake right here. Alrighty, here we go. And just like that, Slurpuff is not getting it. Alright, what are you doing? Okay, so it's raising up its stats right there. Let's go again. Venishock for the win. And there we go. Oh my god. Okay, alrighty. And guy of the Fierce Knight grows level 66. And here comes a Wigglytuff. I'm going to continue with the same old Pokemon right here. And let's see what we can do with Vanishok. Okay, Vanishok. Let's go. Vanishok. Oh my god. Okay, so this Pokemon is a little tough. Again, Vanishok. If all else fails, guys, Vanishok for the win. And that nearly defeats Wigglytuff. And oh my god, we are put to sleep. Yeah. Okay, so... We're going to try and wake up. Let's go with a Giga Drain and see what happens. Yeah. It, as you guys can see, I'm not much for, like, wasting kind of a... Uh, wasting kind of a... Uh, what was it called? Um, items right here. So let's go ahead and try that again. And... Oh, my God. Come on. Wake up. Help us out. There it is. Wake up, man. Come on. Wake up. Talk to Batman. Don't be lame. Do not be lame. Let's go. Oh my god. Okay, so you have woken up. Thank you, Jeebus. Thank you. Alrighty. And, well... That right there raises Toxic Batman to level 57. And, well, Josephine, or... Yeah, I think her name is Josephine. I don't even know. I don't pay attention to the names. Okay, thank you very much. Regrettably, you've lost. Yes, let's move on to the next the next, the next next order of business right here. Now, this place is very big. And would you look at this? That is a familiar face. You. I want to ask you something. Where where am I? Uh, you're in the Hoenn region, homeboy. Hoenn? Hey, what happened to you? You're absolutely soaked in the, uh, to the skin. Even in a tropical place like Hoenn, if you are soaked like that, you'll catch a cold. Ah, uh, yeah. Oh, boy, I guess I have no other choice. Come to my cottage. Oh, okay, cottage? That right there was Looker. Hmm. Hmm. Cool pose. Yeah, I don't have a cool pose like, uh, what's his face? Like, Steven. Now, we're going to put off talking to this guy right here because... He is an integral part to something that we will be getting a little bit later on. 
But as you guys can see right here, you will be finding yourself another Pokemon uh, daycare center where you can, you know, get multiple Pokemon. You can get multiple, or raise multiple Pokemon and all that crud. And, well, if you talk to la this lady, hello, would you like to change uh, music of atmosphere? Yes. Okay, this, this sounds good. Makes me want to skip around. Do 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 do. Anywho, that was part one right here of the battle resort, guys. Uh, part two will be coming up because there's a little bit more that you can find on the exterior part. So thank you guys again for watching. I'll see you guys in the next episode as we take a look at uh, the exterior of Pokemon or the battle resort. See you guys.